Salisbury police are trying to figure out who shot two women in a baby. It happened last night on South Main Street. Queen City News anchor Robin Kennedy is live in Salisbury tonight. So Robin, what have you learned? Morgan, police are only saying that there is no active threat to the community here. They're also bringing in extra federal and state resources to help them find the shooter. And they're looking into whether the shootings in the city recently are gang related. Sirens pierce the night on South Main Street as a frantic neighbor calls for help. Another shooting in Salisbury. This time, a neighbor says a baby girl was one of the victims. A baby, a poor baby shot, an uh, innocent child. Uh, it's a... Uh, uh, it's just a sad situation. The baby wasn't the only one hit by a bullet. A neighbor says the child's mother and another woman were shot. And I can't say it enough. I just can't comprehend somebody going in there and shooting three people. A neighbor says the victims had just come back from a funeral, but police have not confirmed that. Investigators also won't say if the shooting on South Main Street is connected to a man shot and killed at a funeral less than two weeks ago in Salisbury. So it's frustrating. It's very frustrating that um, the community is impacted by this senseless violence and that we need the community members that saw it to step up and, and tell us is, is highly frustrating. Police say the baby shot on South Main Street and one of the women were rushed to Baptist Hospital in Winston-Salem in critical condition and the other woman has been released from the hospital. A neighbor tells us the baby and the mother underwent multiple surgeries. I just can't, I can't fathom it. Uh, it makes no sense. Police say officers are getting overtime doing extra patrols, walking and driving in high crime areas of the city, and they're bringing in extra resources to track down the shooter. And I hope they can catch the person, and I hope they don't give them a slap on the wrist. Now, there was a separate shooting last night in Salisbury. That one was on Old Concord Road near South Shaver Street. A young girl was shot in that incident. Police tell us that she did not have life-threatening injuries, thankfully. Police do not believe that the two shootings last night are connected. I'm live in Salisbury. Robin Kennedy, Queen City News. So